Welcome back to Luigi's Mansion 2. It's been a whole day, and we're ready to capture ghosts. Yeah, it sure has. It, it has most certainly been a whole day. It's been an entire 24 hours. No more, no less. No more and no less. Exactly 24 hours. Exactly. We're also ignoring what the professor told us to do. Yeah, because he's a nerd. He is a nerd. Luigi's a cool guy. Luigi does what he wants. It's cooler than his brother. Oh my god, he disappeared! <laughs> Blinked himself out of existence. Hello. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> The strobe orb allows you to stun ghosts by flashing them. Only then can they be captured. I thought that said mushroom exterior. I don't know why. Actually, I do know why. It's been a while. Since. Whole 24 hours. I heard the squeak of a mouse. Behold! Coin mice. Oh, oh, come back. Jeez, that thing's huge. Mr. Huge. Hello. <laughs> Doing some gemstone hunting on the side. Mm -hmm. Those gems are one of a kind. We're the fortune. But remember, you've got a job to do. Yeah, my job is looking for gems, didn't you know? I'm a professional gem hunter. Okay, well that dog that we, we saw is not out here. Doing that does nothing, so I can only assume... Wait, hold on. I can only assume there are no ghosts right now. Which makes me sad. Makes me have to listen to that nerd. I mean, he's a pretty helpful nerd, so, like, you know, it doesn't hurt to listen to him, but, like, you know, when Luigi wants to do something, Luigi's gonna go do it. Yes. So I'm also not going to forget about this up here. Yep. So there we go. That's the first flub. Jeez. There's money in the sewers. Alright. Now, kids, don't do this at home. <laughs> that Scooby Doo bounce. Well, sit on the revolving toilet. <laughs> Alright, there's one. Okay. I think my net fixed itself. Do you need me to restart? No. 
right? Oh, you yeah. missed a revolving toilet and uh, us pulling the uh, shower curtain off. <laughs> Hold on, Professor. You've got some, some loose dollar bills in your pocket. Uh, I gotta fix that for you. Uh, you now have uh, no more pockets. Brick pockets. Indeed. There we go. Search rooms thoroughly. I seriously don't remember what the the uh, money was for. in the schnage. Yeah. All right. Yeah, that was like oh, a fifth of our yeah. HP, too. That's the spirit, literally. Mm -hmm. I'll bring you back to the bunker. Oh, no. No, 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 no I'm not ready. Oh, yes. All right. Oh, oh. I did it. All right, so here's a progress report, I guess. Clear time. What's this? Tells you how bad you are. I got a two star. Hmm. You're only silver rank. I mean, you get a pretty decent amount of treasure, though. Yeah. <laughs> I guess I could do individual. You could do individual level points with this. Yeah. Yeah, but uh, don't let the time deceive you. We've been in that. We've been in that mansion for 24 hours. <laughs> Actually, 24 hours and 19 minutes. The hour mark actually rolls over once you hit 24 and just goes back to zero, so it works. Overflow. Yeah. That's why you didn't see it. Delicious overflow. Math. My favorite, like, overflow thing is uh, RuneScape has this tracker that tracks the total amount of XP you, you've gained on your character. Um, and it's some... There's some technically specific number, but it's like at 2.4 um, billion. It's like whatever they use is like the that's the highest number it can handle. So after that, it just says lots. <laughs> You've gained a lot of experience. Uh, coincidentally, that same number is also the uh, max cash that you ha you can have. And some items on the player economy are worth more than that max cash stack. <laughs> so the way you do it is there's a a uh, specific there's a specific item you use to train uh, the summoning skill it's called a spirit shard, if I remember correctly. And it, it's bought in a shop, an NPC owned shop. It's the only real way to get it. They are a fixed worth of 25 gold each. So, you know, you just trade the max cash deck and X amount of spirit shards. And that's like how you go. That's how the player economy goes past that. Uh, it is also a lesson to any uh, MMO devs out there on why you do not make limited event only items tradable because it can and will happen to each and every single one of them. <laughs> yeah, and for those wondering, uh, the item is a blue party hut. Well. I think there might be another one that joined it beyond the max cash stack wall, but 
Ghost descriptions, hints, even each ghost spectral mass. I reckon the ghost that took the other dark moon pieces is hiding in the mansion. Least health lost. I wonder what that second thing is. Mm. Alright, so now we get to go back in the mansion. The periscope, a tip top device that detects and measures distant paranormal signals. Alright, Luigi, get ready to be pixelated. E gotta be like, ah, oh, yeah, I remember when I was your age doing this sort of thing like a millennia ago. <laughs> I'm younger than I look. I'm like 2,000 years old. <laughs> the E stands for Eldritch. <laughs> Don't let my birth certificate fool you. It stands for Eldritch Eternal. <laughs> Eternal Gad. <laughs> that ghost comes in. Evil. No, get back in there, ghost. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, as the kids say, Evergreen. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Professor Evergreen Gad, that's me. <laughs> Alright, I'm out of E words. Alright, so here's the fun thing. Uh, so, if I remember correctly, each of these levels will, like, tent sometimes respawn treasure. So, like, that mouse wasn't there before, right? Yeah. That was there. So it's always worth going back in to check these rooms. Also, I know I said that we're gonna like do shorter episodes. There will probably be some longer ones. Just depending on if we run into a segment or two. Yeah. Oh yeah, now that we have the straw bulb, uh, we miss doing this. That's how you open those. We got a gem for our troubles. Jemmy. Uh, Jemmy's my favorite plant. A gem blossom. The gem session. Uh, I don't think we get water powers like we do in the first one. Makes me sad. These plants could use some water, to be honest. <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna... here. I don't think any of the, like, I think some of the gems are, like, um, I think some of the gems are, like, level-specific, but, like, yeah. only in so far as this is the first level that lets you get this far into this building, right? Yeah. You know, if I could get all the way through this manor, you know, on the first level, theoretically all the gems would be available. <laughs> I 
that aside. Oh no. Reached in, took the gears out of the gear, and said, here guys, have this. That's the leader of the moops. He's the leader of the bunch. You know him well. That funky red guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Hello. It's Tronky Kong. <laughs> Spooky Kong. Spooky Kong. Okay, there we go. That's better. <laughs> oh yes, my 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 favorite Spooky Kong. <laughs> Spooky King. <laughs> I, I, I'm still partial to Stronky Kong. <laughs> it's it's just forced enough. <laughs> I'll use the periscope, then you can use the map on the DS. <laughs> the terrified look in your eye just gave me a great idea. Yeah, there it is, the dual scream. Yeah, the Game Boy Terror and the dual scream. Mm -hmm. The map has a whole host of features. Like what, Mr. Mr. Dad? There's one room on the third floor. This door is like half open already. Hello, Mr. Ghost. No, come back. I can't do that yet. All right. They're just little guys. Oh, just the one guy. And just a medium guy. <laughs> Sure. We've already had net problems once. <laughs> now, speaking of catch that, hold on. Oh, I probably should have hit this with a flashlight. Oh well. Uh, I don't know why I can't open this one. Ah, it's blocked. Okay. What's in here? What? Okay, I guess. Secret pocket. Pocket. Oh, a key. Okay. Key. Well, we'll need that for something. Oh, hold on. We can look in here. I, I can. There we go. Get back in position, you scrub. Uh, what's... Ah, that's blocking the door. Okay. We have to find some way of getting in. 
I don't know how we're gonna do that, but we'll have to find it. Here's his lab. All right, where's the thing to turn it all on? Oh. Oh, I was trying to hit both of them. Kill it. All right. Electrocuted himself in the light bulb. Bzzz. Can we interact with anything in here? Oh, it's this. I right, clean up a little bit. Squeaky chair. Holly, you gotta be like, you gotta, you really need a new chair. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know why it lets us interact with this. All right. Well, we can't get in there. Go anywhere else? Cheese? Cheese? Rat? Hole? Alright. Books. They, they... Chilling out? Do anything fun? No, just books. Oh. Just book stuff. Just floating around. Book stuff. Okay. Uh, well. Hmm. That certainly is an odd painting. Well, I think. Nope, okay. Well, I guess we go up to the second floor. I do it. And throw stuff at you. Oh, and the, the blue ones change back to orange. Okay, that's how you know stuff's haunted, I guess. Alright, well, it's definitely not gonna do it again. Alright, now we have the key, so we can, I guess we can go in here. We skipped a step. Oh, jeez. Egad, are you yeah. sure you were living here? I say let's go ahead and go in here the parlor that's 1402 I mean that is accurate to the time a 
and another gym. Hell yeah. Jimmy. Oh, just oh, blah, blah. Oh, no, 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 no. Frick. Give me that back. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. One day we'll have a perfect run. Soon, but. Yeah, I figured it was interacting with this, but I was not expecting so much money to come out. <gasps> Another bone! Oh, those do not carry over between levels. Good to know. I guess those would be really busted if they did, to be honest. Yeah. You know what that makes me wonder? Is there like a free like revive on or not like a free, but like is there like a revive on death item in D D? Um no, I do not believe there is. Alright, well we need something to break this to burn this. <clears throat> to get that. Um I mean, obviously, such a thing would be incredibly rare and expensive if it did exist. But... Yeah. I think what would be better would be like a death prevention thing. So, like, if you were to ever die, you would just it would consume itself and you'd stabilize instead. Yeah. I think there are, like, items like that, that, you know, instead of, like, being unconscious, you, you know, you're either, you know, brought to one or, uh, at least stabilized. But there are definitely quite a few features for classes where it is like, oh, if you are going to be, you know, dropped to zero, you drop to one instead. Oh, this is how you get to the other This also spells like Death Ward. Yeah. I don't know what that does for us, but all right. Hey, I knew there was a second one in here. Goblin. About to say that rats can and will hurt you. So they tend to be somewhat annoying. <laughs> Hurting me, you rat. <laughs> wow, what another strange painting. Uh, did you know bats are dollars? I do now. Yeah, it's amazing they're still around, to be honest, but, you know, good for us. All right, so that turns that off, but I don't know what that does. <laughs> we cannot do that if the carpet's bad. <gasps> Thank you for that. I need that five health back. So now all that's left is to figure out how to get into that one room. And I guess how to get out of here. But we'll have to do that next time.
Until then, Luigi's stuck in here for another 24 hours. You should check back in so you can save him. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Insert Ina gift tomorrow? 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 Tomorrow. Goodbye. Tomorrow. Mario?